Hello guys, welcome to the 28th session of the Entity Framework Code 2.0 tutorials. In this session, we will see the 011 method which was added into the Entity Framework Code 2. Till now, for each book, we have only one author entry and which was showing in the different table. Instead of this, now we want to add the two author entries and both of them will be stored into the book table itself. However, we want to use the different model for the author and a book in the C subside. In that case, one one method is useful. Let's switch to the Visual Studio. I am making the some changes in the both of model. After this session, I will undo those changes. First of all, switch to the author and remove the book reference and open the book in which remove the author id and create the two copy of the navigational property one and two because of we are remove the author id it will generate the some error so we need to comment in the home controller control k c also commenting the Visualizer and run the uh, solution. I'm going to drop the uh, tables and again create. Let's switch to the uh, management studio and uh, we'll refresh the uh, table. Here you can see that it generated the uh, two tables. Let's see the uh, columns of the author. It includes the uh, three fields and let's see the uh, columns of the uh, book which include the uh, six. It has the author one author ID and author two author ID. However, we are interested to store the everything into the uh, just one table. For that, we need to use the uh, one one method. Let's switch to the uh, studio. Stop the uh, project. Open the uh, context. In the on model creation method, we need to write the model builder dot entity of a book oh one one b such that b dot author one and we also need to specify for the author two. Let's run it. And now I'm going to drop the existing table. Table are deleted and recreate those tables. Let's switch to the management studio. Refresh the tables. It was generated three tables book, book author one, and author two. Let's see the columns. Book table contains only four fields. Let's open the author one columns. It contains the uh, three field. Now it includes the book ID. And same for the author two. As per the Microsoft documentation, the columns would be in the one table. I don't know what happening here. Okay, I will submit the issue on the GitHub and update the video if I got the any solution. Let's see what we are learning this session. O11 property allows us to use the uh, different model for the uh, same table. Here we are making uh, some changes in the uh, our classes. From both of the uh, classes, we are remove the author ID, and in the case of the uh, author, we are also remove the uh, navigation property, and in the uh, book, we are add the uh, two author detail, so create the uh, two navigational property. In the on model creating method, we need to write the uh, own one method and we need to pass the lambda expression within it. Thanks for watching.